Developers at this year's Cityscape Abu Dhabi have announced that a number of residences in various market segments, over 20,000 units, are scheduled for delivery this year. Industry experts foresee a lull in demand as the capital gets oversupplied. Rents in the first quarter dropped 8% as new villas and apartments entered the market, and with new units expected to be handed over throughout the year, the sliding trend in rental prices is likely to continue. Investors may see this as bad news, but analysts say it is ultimately beneficial for Abu Dhabi's economy. This is actually very good news for Abu Dhabi. It makes it quite more competitive. It brings down rents, which, of course, um, companies here bear the cost, and it effectively brings down the employment costs here. So it encourages companies, it encourages job growth. Lenders say the decline in rents in the capital will have a big impact on the mortgage market. Existing tenants and homeowners are likely to upgrade to bigger units and will need to take out housing loans. The case is the same for new residents. 2011 is the, is the year of delivery, so with delivery will come uh, existing buyers who need to finance their properties and new buyers who need to finance their new purchases. So the demand for mortgages in Abu Dhabi is only set to grow and we're very well placed to meet the needs of those customers. Experts believe there will be more than enough residences for Abu Dhabi's current population in the next two years. However, the government expects a surge in the number of residents in the coming years as it oversees the construction of a number of commercial developments that will create job opportunities throughout the capital. Zina Zalamea, Alroya.com, Abu Dhabi.